So Sandy, what are your thoughts on like people freaking out about panel gas? So you take your finger, okay, and you run it down with your eyes closed. Try it out. Feel like oh it. Oh my gosh, it is so roomy. Yeah. Wow. And uh, where am I right now? Let's look at this UI. Right. Terry's to pop these off now. It's designed to get dirty, so we're gonna, it's gonna be a little bit different than everything we've seen before. I'm in the process, how are you? Hi. My, my gosh. You brought your own photographer. This is my husband. He's the <laughs> one that's behind the camera. Very nice good. Nice being here too. So we do it all together. Like it's always been the two of us, but no one ever oh. sees him. What do you think? I, I'm, I'm really blown away. I, I'm really, really happy. It's, it takes a bit because it's so bloody big. Um, and I did smash the gate here a bit. Um, we don't want to have too many people know that, but. But, uh, but, <laughs> but you just told. But everyone. I just told everyone. Yeah. And and we're back. Gosh, and you're gonna get a chance to drive it on the way back. Yeehaw! <laughs> yeah, that is We're, so awesome. How does it drive? It's like a dream. It's it's yeah. fabulous. How does it feel and compared to other different Teslas? Does it feel like a Model no. X or just like its no, own? No, it doesn't thing? feel like anything anything that uh, that that Tesla put out. Um, this has got you know um, rear steering as well as front steering. There's no steering shaft. Yeah, it's it's drive by wire. Um, you can turn on a dime. Uh, it's very easy to operate in uh, in a parking lot like this if you are paying attention to yeah. what you're supposed to be doing instead of paying attention <laughs> to some goof. Who's, hey, hi, did, hi, I'm taking your picture. Did you, did you drive it into water? Does it float like a boat? <laughs> no, we didn't get anything that deep. You haven't, you haven't given me that yet, but okay. I will tell you. Uh, that windshield wiper, that huge windshield wiper there. Yeah. We're testing yeah, it out right that, now. Uh, that definitely, uh, that definitely is handy. I okay. mean, it's really seriously. And then the uh, the turn signals. Uh, you do have the rear view mirrors, like you, the two yeah. wing mirrors. However, um, I'm not a big fan of wing mirrors because they are. Oh my gosh. How are you? Oh my gosh. I'm well. Oh my I'm gosh. well. I'm, <laughs> I'm looking at your. I love it. You like this? You like this jacket? Oh, we got matching ones. Oh my gosh! You guys are like the en Bobsy twins. En engineer team special gift. Wow. Yes. Wow. We gotta get Sandy one of these. Oh, we didn't get one of those, but I gave them one. But anyways, Good. at the end of the day, no, it's a brilliant. It's a brilliant car. A truck. Yeah. It's not a car. And the best part about this is the back seat is. Finally, uh, a good Tesla backseat. Did you try this? I haven't been in it yet. Wait I haven't that's even. That's provocative. It's right in front of your husband. <laughs> that's what not she that said. Kind of truck, okay. Anyways. Wait, how did you open it's, it? You just push the button. You just press. Yeah, there's no door Why handles. Why is it so muddy? Where have you taken this? I got it muddy. I didn't get it muddy. I received it muddy. Nice. But try it out. Okay. It's not muddy on the seat. You'll get it. You'll like it. Oh my gosh, it is so roomy. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. This is yeah. amazing. It is definitely comfortable for three adults, big adults. I'm only 5'5", five five, but like, look at all this leg room. Plenty of height up here for my head. The screen, I love all the details, how it's like angular, like a complete cyber truck on the inside. Like everything has like all those extra details in here. Wow, I'm just like, where do I even look? This is my first time in a cyber truck. I'm losing my mind right now. And uh, where am I right now? Let's, let's look at this, this UI. So we're at the right height right now. Right now it's on entry. So this is as low as it goes. Um, I don't know if I can uh, if I can change. I think I can change the ride height here. Let's go up. Okay. So now it's I can feel it's moving up. And we're looking at uh, I think it's nine or nine or ten inches. This thing goes up. So it's perfect for any kind of water for sure. And it's still going. Like Can you click so, on outlets and mods? What's that? Outlets and mods. That just tells you where all of the okay. power feeds are. So here, let's do this because everybody wants to see the front yeah, open. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna put this thing back down. I'm gonna put this down to entry level and. Um, yeah, nice. Take me a, a little oh, bit. Look at that. And look at we've got squatters yeah. already plugging up the front yeah. end here. <laughs> no, I don't think there's a Maybe you so now you can see the tunnel with uh, oh, yeah. the down. It's, it's, it's around five, maybe a little less feet over there. And then this um, adds about maybe a foot and a half, two feet. So you've got enough room to, you know, 
park. Certainly got enough room for quads yeah. and uh, probably a couple of bikes. And stuff Can we like talk to about the battery yet? Or did you have to sign an no. NDA? I, yes. So I, yes. I this won't go out though until. I love you, but not that much. I signed that thing and it looks like uh, that, that would be a, okay. an issue. For okay. Me. But, uh, but no, I, I absolutely uh, love the truck. I mean, uh, they were very generous, but we got to bring it back. In what about, about the turning minutes. radius? Can tell something on about a dime. that? It, on a dime? Yeah. It's Does really, it tur- literally because, turn, though, like on a dime? Does it well, turn no, like these wheels? These wheels will move. The rear wheels move, like, I think it's 10 degrees. Okay. So if you spin that and you can move the wheels 10 degrees, now what you've done is you've cut your turning radius in by a half. So. So that's a huge yeah. opening. So yeah, how you doing? Hey, good. How you doing? It's muddy for you. Yeah, it's, it's getting there. <laughs> just for you. I know. I asked him. I was like, "Is it dirty?" This is crazy. Everybody has just like come out to check this out. It's like the early preview before the actual event, and Sandy is really the only one who has gotten a hands-on tour of it. So we're all flocking this guy right here, which we would flock anyways because it's Sandy. I don't know for sure, but I can tell you that. Yeah. Um, I can tell you there's a lot of things that in our videos. Okay. We have dirty Tesla showing off the dirty <laughs> Cybertruck. Um, so yeah, it's looking really good. Feels I don't know. I've just I've never touched the Cybertruck. I will say it's cool to the touch. This definitely feels just like a piece of stainless steel. So Sandy, what are your thoughts on like people freaking out about panel gas? About what? Like panel gas with this thing. I already went through, I, I did that a few minutes ago. Yeah. And you don't have to be an expert, but anybody that knows anything about trucks, is you have gaps that are bigger in trucks. Uh, and the reason for that is because you're going to be taking them into muddy areas and you want everything to flush out. Okay. So, just a second. I won't take long. Okay, so you take your finger, okay? And let me see how your finger's a little smaller than mine. But anyway, you just take your finger and you run it down with your eyes closed. Okay, and you try and feel if there's a if there's a difference as you move down. Okay, and there isn't any. And then if you take your finger, can I? Oh, can you slide back? Oh, okay. I just need to close the door for a second. Okay. Jump right in there. There you go. <laughs> Forced to sit in, it. and then you do the same thing over here, and you do the same thing over here. You find that that gap's bigger. And this is a little bit bigger because. Because from front to back, uh, I can't pinch. Uh, I'll get I'll get pinched okay. if I open both. So do you think this is just the way they'll all be? Then we'll have. Some I'm pretty sure you're gonna. That's yeah, and, like a yeah, that's probably what's gonna part happen. Part of the but design. See that this one is the same. Absolutely. And if you look at this, yeah. it's the same as. That's why they want a big takeaway. But they're gap, even. And that gap to be the same. And that's kind of like that's what they've done. And by the way, remember too. This is pre-production. What they're really trying to do is how do I how do I make sure that this thing works the way it's supposed to? You know, everything's safe and whatnot. So this, these kinds of trucks uh, or these kinds of products um, are design intent, but they're not ready for prime time. They're not ready okay. to be sold, and that's why I can't open the um, I can't do the ramp. I can't do the ramp. I can't uh, put it on uh, self-driving. I can't. Have you tried uh, popping off the arrow covers? No, I don't want to touch that. <laughs> you don't want to get all dirty? I don't want to get all dirty. Well, I don't care. I, uh, when I get mine, uh, we're talking soon. We, we got to go? We got to get going soon. Okay, all right. All right. Okay, so fine. Driving. All right, thank uh, you, you so can, much. If you want, yeah. Okay. Yeah, Monroe guys. Yeah, Monroe guys. <laughs> thank you. It's good so, to see you. So nice. Yes, I'm hugging you right in front yes. of your husband and everything. <laughs> Thanks okay. a lot. Thank you, Sandy. Thank you. Okay. Get a good look. I am really curious to pop these off. Now, what's interesting about this it's almost like rubberized, where other arrow covers are kind of like more metal. It's harder in here, but this outer part is rubberized. Again, this is a truck. It's designed to get dirty, so it's, we're gonna. It's gonna be a little bit different than everything we've seen before. Look at this front trunk. <laughs> Jim Java gets that taken out by the cyber hey, truck. You would have been the first casualty to us. <laughs> it's crazy to me that it's just one giant light bar. This is something I've never seen before. And then apparently we'll find out there'll be an accessory to go up here too with like an LED light strip, which would be And this thing is seriously dirty and it's raining, so we're seeing it in action.
next time on Kim Java. We are one of the lucky few to snag invites to the Cybertruck delivery event. Kimmel Musk is right here. <laughs> I'm shocked that they're letting me film in here. I, why don't they sell this? Check this out, they have a little mini. This is the stuff that you never get to see. And as we get closer to the stage, the Cybertrucks are becoming more and more put together. Look at this, this is the wheel assembly. Check this out, they're putting the wheel. I'm gonna do it from the back of the truck oh, here. Good. It's the exact same specs as my Rivian for more money. I thought the tri-motor was gonna be deep into the $100,000 range. This is Eventually. costing so much more than they clearly had intended in yeah. 2019 that they probably feel like, all right, well, we've gotta get yeah. a single motor out there.